Right, the other big story from the world of business. Microsoft has announced that full-time employees would not get a pay rise this year due to the economic climate. But the company will continue to offer bonuses, stock awards and promotions. Well, I guess that's some respite there. In January, the tech giant decided to lay off 10,000 workers in preparations for the upcoming tumultuous year. Now, Microsoft followed other tech companies in doing so. Of course, we've seen a series of tech layoffs. The tech giant is now primarily focused on the profitable generator of artificial intelligence or AI. Microsoft has been integrating AI technology into its Office products and Bing search engine with ChatGPT developer OpenAI. ChatGPT has received billions of dollars in financing from the tech firm. As part of a massive rollout aimed at closing the gap with Google, Microsoft made accessible to users a whole slew of AI enhancements, including the chat GPT, its search engine Bing, and its cloud services. Among the most notable updates is the incorporation of real-time Bing search results into the popular OpenAI chatbot chat GPT, whose replies were previously restricted to data only. Meanwhile, Alphabet's Google is set to test ads in generative AI search results. That is to compete with Microsoft in the lucrative search ads industry. Google and Microsoft, they've stepped up their competition to revolutionize the way people search for information here. The Wall Street Journal reported that Samsung Electronics has no plans to switch the default search engine on its cell phones from Google to Microsoft's Bing. Long-term agreements with mobile device manufacturers like Apple and Xiaomi contribute significantly to search engines' bottom lines. The New York Times reported on the 16th of April that the Samsung arrangement brings in an estimated $3 billion in yearly revenue for Google.